Hi friends, this is Leela. Welcome to my channel. In the previous video, we have seen how to make the get request here seen, right? In this video, we will see how to define the types for the HTTP database, for HTTP requests. So for example, in the TypeScript, as we already know, it's a strong type language, right? So how to mention the types for this one, Type the type of data, what is the type of data we are getting and how to mention the type of data, we will see in this video. Okay, so before continuing to this video, so if you are coming first time to my channel, please do support me by subscribing to my channel so that I will be posting more and more front-end development courses. Now coming to this video, we will see here, here if you see the get post, okay, the get post. So here, this is the method where we are getting the post details. And if you go and if you see here the data and here if you see the response, we are getting the response as an object, okay, we are getting the response as an object. And if you go here the post, post we are getting the type as an any. Okay, the, we are we are able to see that post is a type of any. So, but we know the type of post. What is the data getting from the uh, from the server? We know the type of data. So, let's define the type of the data with an interface. Let's create a method. So, let's go here and let's create a file that is post.model.ts. So, why, however you want to mention, you can mention. So, I am creating a file post.model.ts. So what are the name you want you can give and here i am writing export class post okay the post is we already know we can it contains title of type string and it contains content of type string and also another one is the uh, how we are framing the data here we are framing the data with the key right so we will be having the key and this one is not a uh, comp uh, mandatory field so it is an optional so we are keeping uh, question mark be before that one and here this is the post now i can go to here and i can mention the response the type of response how i will be getting from here the response how i will be getting is so here i will be getting the type as so key you will be having so it's an object okay you will be getting it's an object and here you will be getting what i can say key of type string so it can be of any type so that is id we are getting the id and here i will be getting the post i can mention the post like this okay so now let's import that post here so import from post model and here this one will be the post let import the post here and here we will be having the post okay now this post is of type we know that this one is of type post array array of posts this is of type array of posts and here now if you see here it is returning the array of posts and here you will be getting the response of type post right you will be getting the array of post here okay so you will be getting the response so it is returning the response and you will be getting the response of array of post so we are returning the data and here if you see here if you go here and if you write title and you will be getting able to get the title okay fine let's see and here so this is this is how we can mention the data so now here if you see the response it is of type post and here if you see it is containing this dot post so this dot post is of type we know that it is of type we will be mentioning the type of type post okay so we have mentioned like this and if you go down so we will be able to see that the post it is post dot post it is post component post it is of type array of post now if you go here and if you mention title okay here you will be able to see the title so whatever the thing you will be having you will be able to see you will be able to show here key you will be able to see the intelligence there so that is the reason we will be using the types now here we have mentioned everything using the uh, using the type and now we can go here and we can also mention the on create post also so on create post the response what we will be getting it is of type name with an string you will be getting the name with a string so you will be getting the name and with an id we will be getting right so this is the response i am showing so this is how we will be mentioning the types in the http request and also here one thing you need to remember that instead of mentioning it here you can also mentioning the generic type so you can copy this entire thing and you can mention it here angle brackets and you can mention it like this so then here the response will be in such a way that the response will be here it is of type key of string post c 
and here you can mention so same thing happens so this is this is the also the way how we can mention as a generic type okay and here also you can mention this one as a generic type also you can mention so post the written type of that post will be something like like this one so that the response there is no need to mention for us the response the response will be here the response will be of type name and string so but we are declared but we are never using so that is another reason so this is the type how we will be mentioning so these are this is how we will be mentioning the type data the type of data in the HTTP request so we can have you can mention using the generic type that before the after the get you can mention like this generic type and also in the in the in the response also you can mention the type of data and the type of data you can mention it in the post dot model yes here mention you can mention class or interface also you can write okay whatever thing you want you can write so this is how we will be maintaining the uh, we will be creating the types for the HTTP request if you have any doubts or any suggestions please post the comments below to this video and if you like this video don't forget to subscribe to my channel thank you